what's up? Bradley Aiden Johnson here with another indispensable diet tool. Now this one's going to seem so obvious, uh, you're going to rage at me, but um, it really isn't. You'd have to be dieting for a while to know how important this is. A good tin opener. Now I go through three tins of vegetable soup a day at the moment, and even when, one second, hold on, I've got water running. I go through three tins of soup at the moment a, a day and um, I'm going to be adding tuna back into diet. That's four tins to open a day. Back when I was making tuna burgers and cooking for the week, I was making all of that in one day, which means I was opening 28 tins of tuna on a Monday. And um, it, it's a pain. You need a good tin opener. Now, if this was about five or six months ago, I would be singing the praises of this thing here. This is an electrical tin opener. The way it works in theory is you put it on the top there. You press this button, it sucks on, it spins around and opens the tin in about 25 seconds. Now these are fantastic, I'm not knocking these, it's alright, but they're fantastic only when you first get them. When you first get them, you put them on, they, oh, brilliant, comes off and you, you want to call your best friend and tell them how wonderful they are. As they go on, they get duller and duller, the mechanism works less and less, and you find you're spending so much time trying to make it work, that it would have been probably easy just to stick a knife in the metal and just claw the thing open yourself. So what I have found since then is what is, I will go out on a limb here and say, the world's finest, notice the insignia there, IKEA, the world's finest tin opener. I'm going to try and give a demonstration of this and how great this tin opener is with one hand. I'm not sure if, if with one hand this is possible, but as you can see, you open it and you just, with one hand, you click it on, it's open, and maybe with one hand is a bit much. Let's see if I can use my more dead hand. No, I'm not going to be able to. Oh, maybe from this angle. No, there you go, yeah. Basically. This is the world's greatest tin opener. Now the video might not be showing how fantastically easy it is. It doesn't require me to squeeze anything and the twisting motion is just tips of my fingers. Oh, it's fantastic. Is that open? I think that's open. Damn, yeah, that's open. And what it does is it cuts the top off clean all the way. See the difference there? It cuts all that top bit off, which is the same thing the electrical one does without leaving a sharp bit here. This isn't sharp at all, as you can see. Yeah, some fingers. Cuts the cleaning top, which prevents any of the metal. Because you know sometimes you use the uh, the tin openers and it cuts around the top, and it's like some of the metal gets into your stuff, and it's ugh, it's a bit nasty. And some of the the all the stuff kind of mixes together. I don't like that. You know, I like, I like my top to come clean off. Now I'm sorry if this video seems a bit stupid and a bit obvious, but you have got to be dieting for a while, opening a lot of tins to realise some of these little things can make a lot of difference to the amount of time that you spend in the kitchen. Because one of the most important things about dieting is the quicker you're in and out of the kitchen and eating the less chance you have of skipping your diet, getting a takeaway, doing something that isn't following precisely your diet. So hopefully it's been a little bit of a help to you. I'm sorry if it seems really obvious, but trust me, it took me a long time to find the perfect tin opener and I've opened a lot of tins this year. So uh, yeah, <laughs> if you hate this topic or you think it was good or anything at all, you want to talk about anything and want me to do a different video or do a video on any topic at all, just send an email to bradleyadenjohnson at gmail.com or put a comment on the page or put a YouTube response or send a carrier pigeon my way or send a, a bomb that explodes and writes the letters in the wall and for the thing you want to talk about. Whatever it is, just get in contact with me. There's a million ways, Instagram, Twitter, etc. And uh, I'll do a video on that. Uh, have a good day. Good luck in your diets and ciao.